Good morning, traders. It is Friday, November 28th, 2014. U.S. stock market is closed. I may look a little rattier than usual. Uh, this morning, I, 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 wa I watched the open, uh, took a couple of screenshots, put the kid in charge, and went out for a long run. I just got back. <laughs> When I looked at what happened today, I didn't miss too much. Uh, it, it was Today was a short session, three hours, and what happens, no, three and a half hours. Uh, but what happens uh, when we only get three and a half hours is that isn't long enough for us to trigger any of our exits. So we get out of nothing uh, except when we got get stopped out and uh, we actually did get stopped out one trade in our, our arborbutyl autobutyl uh, today but uh, aside from that we're hanging on to everything you know it was a pretty disappointing day even though we didn't lose money we had um, eight thousand dollars in open trade equity on the close yesterday and when I went out the door after about an hour, we had like $23,000 in open trade. It looked like, you know, a great day. <laughs> Come back and, yeah, they gave back almost all of it. Now, that's the bad news. The, only, the good news is that we're, we're not out of these trades. We didn't exit these trades at the end of the day like we normally do because the day wasn't long enough to exit. So we're going to be carrying these positions into Monday, and I pray to God that uh, the, the the markets decide to go up on Monday because we 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 would like to get back uh, some of those nice profits that we were holding earlier on today. Anyway, crazy holiday market, very thin also, and I noticed something that is a little bit encouraging that the Dow. Uh, was negative, you know, the la very, you know, within seconds to go, it was like down seven and it popped up to about plus five right at the end. So there were buy orders uh, coming in uh, from institutions uh, right on the close, and sometimes that can mean it's going to go up on Monday. Who knows? Anyway, uh, we, we closed out uh, negative $1,500 in that one position, and we are holding positive $3,000 going into Monday. Let's take a look at the Okay, we're looking at the Dow here, and, and, and today's action is, is over here. And you can see uh, we got pretty close. Or my, maybe we actually bounced the top of the all-time record uh, intraday high, which is over here uh, a few days ago and uh, this is what I want to see us take out and as you can see what happened we we hit the ceiling there and then it backed off quite a bit. I, I think the Dow may have been up a hundred points there I'm not sure if it was that high but it was up pretty solid uh, when this happened and of course that's when uh, our open trade equity was pretty high. Uh, actually, more like about here, uh, we we hit our our highest point was I think was about positive twenty two thousand. By the time we end up down here, we're positive three thousand. So uh, we're we're hoping for a rebound here. I am optimistic that uh, possibly on Monday uh, the Dow could take off and take out these highs over here and and, and really head for uh, uncharted territory. But, you know, who knows? Maybe it will continue this slide. I, I just don't know. Anyway, I'll, sh I'll show you what was driving me crazy today. This is, this is um, w just one of the uh, stocks we had trouble with, Agio. Agios uh, Pharmaceuticals, and we had bought this yesterday, and it, it closed in our favor, but I mean, this morning, it's just this massive spike here. When we're at the top here, I mean, this is a full hour into the day, so this is not some morning, you know, uh, some morning open flash in the pan. This thing really 
what looks wrong here. We were up like almost six thousand dollars, if not six thousand dollars, when it got up here, and then look, it just collapsed and it comes back to uh, break even. So, you know, what are you gonna do? I, I, I hope it goes up Monday. That's all I can say. But there's a six thousand dollar reversal there, and this was a pattern that was repeated in uh, other. Uh, positions we're holding. This is Bita, same type of deal. We got this thing uh, on Wednesday, and uh, I th think I maybe I said yesterday on on the other one. But anyway, this is Wednesday before Thanksgiving, and again, an hour into the day, we get this big spike up. We're up about 3,500 with Bita, and again, it comes back to couple hundred dollars profit at most so we we have this across the board with all our positions and we need uh, definitely want to see this overall market as measured by the Dow to take off on Monday morning and then we'll have a chance of getting out of these with some of these nice profits we'll just have to wait and see anyway I'm not gonna let this uh, <laughs> mess up the rest of my weekend and I don't want it to mess up mess up your weekend either uh, enjoy yourself for the next two days I'll be back online on Monday